Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 17. Here, well I might well say welcome to Corn Belt. That's right folks, we're back on Corn Belt. I'm driving all out in the grass, I know, but gotta get some fertilizer. Got about 80,000 left after this load, so, uh, but this should hold us. Come pretty close anyway. Folks, how y'all doing? Y'all doing all right? Yeah, I'm getting peachy myself. But today is going to be a little bit different episode here on Corn Belt. We are going to do a tour of the town as soon as I get this unloaded. Whoa, 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 slow down. Alright, we're going to have to dump it in here. I think it's this first one. Go ahead and take the tarp off. Stop, stop. Oh, 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 right there. Okay, so it's not that. It's this one. Oh, there we go. Well, we're in the early spring, and as you can see, in state we got snow. Really? About like our weather. But anyway, we're gonna let this empty out. Some of our fertilizers are out of fertilize and uh and, and this is where we need to be um why well we're fixing sell some equipment folks don't worry the big tractors are not going to go for sale uh we're gonna let me sell these get them out of the way and then uh we're gonna do something a little bit different go ahead and get this combine Selling this combine because it's really not quite realistic. Goes way too fast. But other than that, it does pretty good. I should have shut that off. But oh well. Oh, that made it much quieter. Oh yeah, I got back out. Come back in. Oh, it's down there. No. I'll take this and push it. And I'm selling these cultivators because, well, we can't hire a worker with them. And I, I need to be able to hire a worker. All right. I know that ain't realistic, but maybe that's good enough on one of them to sell. Uh huh. Now, hopefully, the corn header. Yes, there we go. There we go. Okay, we're going to get this tractor out of the way before it sells. So, we're up to 611,000, which is not bad at all. But, uh, yes, we're going to do a map tour, folks. A map tour. And it's uh, for one particular family member of mine. Uh, my YouTube family, that is. And uh, this gentleman was asking about uh, what the town is like here. So, we're just going to show them real quick. Well, it won't be quick. We're going to do a full tour of the town. Shut you off. But this gentleman is World War Three Gaming. World War Three Gaming. He's the, the link to his channel is down below in the description. So be sure and go over and check him out, please. Awesome gamer. He does different games than I do, so that would might be the balance between the, the two. But anyway, oh, didn't want to break out the chainsaw. Let's see here. I'm going to get rid of my hub here so we can make it a little bit easier. 
But we got the M3 Morgan's Massive Motors. That's where we buy and sell our machinery, of course. Sell points over there. And the store is right there. And that's just some of the, the, the fields out there. And we, well, I can't do the map right now. Well, I'll do the map here in a minute. Um, and yes, we got American flag out here. And uh, this is on the way into the town. When I come in, we can go three ways. Uh, we'll go that way here in a minute. But in here, we just got our basic stores. Uh, what are that? Spun Spunny's Extended Hot Dogs. Oh. Okay. I can stop that any minute now, right? Just want to come down a little bit that way and give a little bit more uh, detail of it. And this is the other side of Mac Massey Motors. It's kind of like Gold Crest map, if any of you all have seen that. Here's the back side of our sales spot. And this here is the wool. Golden Yawn Spinnery. You go ball of wool up there, or yawn, I should say. Uh, right in here is the sell point for the wool. It's not marked whatsoever. But back here, I put, it, put in our uh, chicken spot. Local chicken dealer. Where we buy and sell chickens. Pretty neat mod. But going on around this way, we just got a bunch of houses and stuff. But y'all look at the trees and the, it would be nice. Uh oh, OJ Simpson's uh, Bronco. Uh, Row going out to some fields there. Couple more houses. And we can go up here and take a look. But that's pretty much in the town. Up here we got the biogas. So let's go take a look at it real quick. Then we'll get back into town. Uh, auto save, I hope. Been having some trouble with a couple of my maps of freezing. Okay, that was a long auto save. Where's the gate? Okay, here's the gate right here. This is how we get in. Um, this is where we sell a liquid manure. Uh, biogas is here. I wonder what that's eight. I bet it's digestate, maybe. But we sell our um, silage here. Um, no bio, uh, no corn biofuel up here that I know of. Uh, let's see here. We do have a. Here's where we store our diesel fuel that this does make, makes biogas, but it makes it off the silage, not the corn. So yeah, uh, storage shed, here's where we can uh, store chaff and stuff to turn it into silage. So yeah, that's what this plant's for, and it's just, uh, I believe it's north of the town. And to come back over here, we got, ooh, we got some massive rocks here. That's pretty much where I left off right there, and we'll come around. It's just more houses. There's another thing up there. We'll take a look at it just real quick. It's... Thought this might be a sale point, but it's not. But it's, it's inside of the town here. And let's let me go ahead and put my hood back on. Might as well. It's not taking up too much. You can see right there, top right, where we're flashing. That's part of our town. Um, up over this way, we really don't have too much other stuff here. Kitty Quantum Computing. Okay. Uh, computer store. 
mineral accessories. And same thing on this side, just a different number on the building. Uh, open farmland out that way. Right there is our chicken coop and our sheep. I wouldn't mind living in one of these houses. Looks pretty decent. Two car garage with uh, a high driveway. Yeah, uh, going around this way. Uh, this is the silo here where we can store some crops and stuff. Uh, in this case, we can uh, wheat and hopefully straw. I don't know if we can store straw there or not. But we need a, a place. Ah, oh, there's our chickens running around. But this is the mod I put in. You do uh, like wheat or barley straw and water and they produce egg and this is an automatic egg collector but if I didn't have it ooh, we got some eggs up in here let me get back down to earth yeah, I don't know how we collect them Not too tall. I'm down to earth. Hmm. Oh well. But this thing's long down through here. Ah, chainsaw. We got 200 chickens, eggs, and baskets. Seven eggs. Hmm. But as long as we got wheat, barley, and corn. Water, the chickens will produce eggs and they'll lay them in a the basket. So, no biggie there. Uh, we can sell straw, solage, solage bales, and stuff there. This is our sheep area. Of course, y'all done seen that. We produce wool here. And uh, there's the rest of the town over there. We're going to go on out this way. And we buy our sheeps right here. Okay, our fertilized place is empty, so we need some manure and stuff to put in it. Alright, we're going back down this way. Let's walk down through here. Goldcrest Valley Farmers Union. <laughs> down there attorneys at law all right uh, I don't think that's normal minivan sitting in the side of a pickup truck okay dokey waffles anybody want to go to waffle house I ain't that a song waffle house <laughs> Cool hats. Hyper cube pizza. Uh, we're going to go on around over here. The plane houses back that way. There's. Uh, did I come this way? I don't think I did. Oh, there's a wool. Denton Bakery. Uh, this is supposed to be a cell point, I think. I can't remember for what though. Well, in other maps, you can uh, sell some. Uh, I, I can move a chair, a table. Yeah, I ain't going to destroy their stuff. Nice little setup there. A uh, water fountain right there. And yeah, what we got here? Alleyway. Any triggers? Nope, no triggers back here. Nope, okay, same sign. There's Morgan's Massive Motors. Let's go back over here. What we got? There's boxes. Okay. 
on this back side of the buildings. Maplefield Visitor Center. Two or three towns in one. And y'all check out the prices. I'm glad our prices ain't like that here. Three forty seven for a regular. And here it's like uh round two ten a gallon, somewhere like that. It varies. Alright, uh let's see. Yeah, the sheeps was over that way. You can see their pen right there. So, and, and I started right down there. There's a gas station. Uh, library and bookstore. Yay, we got a bookstore. Uh, Goldcrest Arcade. All right. Oh. Oh, no American flag. Yay. Okay. Um. Uh, whatever that is, hardware, visuals, cakery, and back where we was on the hot dogs. There's that pizza sign. Uh, this a uh, real good gas station there. I don't know if we can get gas from there or not. Uh, this place is fenced off, looks like. But this is the animal deal. When you uh, sell you, buy your animals and stuff. Uh, this is one of the granaries. Uh, can't see it on the map there. Let's go in here real quick and see if we can find out what this is uh, something of barbecue value barbecue one spinnery uh, there's a gas station I don't have that on the map so I don't know if it's part of it or not so anyway I don't know if this is a, this might be our storage place. Uh, there's where we'll sell, or store fuel. So this might be, yeah, this is where we bring our logs right here and put them on the train by the crane there if we wanted to. And those are just uh, storage bins way it looks where's our fuel valves yeah there's there's our gauge for the storing of fuel uh oh so i said did i get myself locked out but uh right here is caster food incorporated okay i was wrong this is Cow, pig, and sheep delivery. Surely it's not. I gotta check this out. I think I found something new, folks. Ha, ha, ha. Output sausage. Ain't this some um, output something other meat? There, there's two things. Looks like it. I don't see no other. Yeah. Well, I found something new. Yeah, and what I'm talking about is you can bring your cows up here and your pigs. The pigs be sausage and the meat would be your cows. But I don't know where you would take them to sell them at. That's the thing. Wow. 
there's here in our uh, store all the way over yeah right here Castro Food Incorporated we got the uh, two animal trailers and this here supplies the refrigerator trailer for transport of sausage and meat semi trailers can be attached to a tractor by using a dolly thirty two thousand liters we're gonna have to try that but I don't know where where in town takes it huh thank you World War three gaming you just uh, taught me something new I guess you can say how to get sausage oh piggies cows y'all better watch out better watch out but folks uh, that's pretty much the it on town wise um, I am going to use this little mod called transport go over here and show y'all this other little spot real quick uh, y'all already seen this if y'all watched before uh, got milk tank here water tank um, I guess place to store pallets looks like uh, which will probably be one of the other things probably a sale point for slurry and and uh, manure and that's sewage and hay bales and stuff like that this is your animal dealer on this map and if you're on around you got another little small town or community you got a uh, groovy gasoline Woohoo, groovy oh and See if there's a name on this building. No, this uh, figured it might be somewhere. So now this is a hotel off of Go Chris. Ha ha. And uh, over here, it's our kind of like a bypass. We got a road that goes under. And an interstate here. Oh, if I don't get run over. Okay, and the fence blocks you off. Great. Okay, yeah, that's the other part of the hotel. This side, now the gas station on this side is a, a groovy gasoline. Also, there's our oil rigs in the background working. I wish we was getting money off it, but we do get. I thought I seen a sign. This. The trees. Okay. Same building. But we do get the oil off of these. But we got to process it. We got to bring a pickup truck, I mean, a tanker up here, trailer truck tanker, and hook into this right here, and we get crude oil off of it. And if you check out some of my other episodes uh, there's a train that comes by here too American oil pump hmm. now this is pretty neat West Bridge Hills Ha uh -huh. But there's several of these on the map. And there's a train that you can bring right here and, and dump it in the train. Or you can uh, just get the truck and you take these to a place. Uh, well, matter of fact, that's what this icon right here is. We'll visit it real quick. I'm fixing to wrap this up, folks. Don't, don't worry. Uh, 
this is a grain silo place and should be an oil pump place too okay well uh, this is just a silo so but here's another oil fill place you can go to and this here is uh, the sawmill and manure and we make seeds at and make for field meal is here and uh, this will be the last one folks y'all seen this is where I usually take my stuff to to sell pretty neat little location Okay, so back this way would be the town area. I'm going to put my hopper boots on. But no little gas station right here. Freedom Fuels. Woohoo! Still the same price, though. No little small community. Still got like two or three little communities here. Go Crest Arcade, Good Value Barbecue. Wait a minute. It's not marked. But I bet you, here's Morgan's Massive Motors. There's this extra building. And here's a little place. Uh. Fishes and rice, sushi bar. Wow. Real estate. Go back around over here. Denton Bakery. I bet that's part of Denton Bakery. Yep. That's where I was getting that from my go. But uh, some of these places uh, has triggers that's not even down where you can recognize it. Not auto save, which I'm glad it does auto save, but uh, it gets annoying sometimes. But folks, it's going to wrap up the tour. Uh, Y'all can thank uh, World War III Gaming for the tour. Just want to show him out because he helps support my channel. And uh, if any of y'all have any other questions or, or anything y'all want to see on any map, just be sure and leave it in the comments and I will try to get to it as soon as I can. Uh, volume of comments been kind of high, so uh, I will get to them as I get to them. But uh, yeah, World War III, I just want to thank you for your comment and uh, hope this helps you out, show you around. And uh, pretty good uh, things on the house. They did take time, but as you can see right here, the house is floating on this side, but not on this side. But, you know, ain't none of us perfect. But I do like the way it's set up. I'm just not the out in the desert type of guy. But, uh, yeah. I guess this is going to conclude the uh, tour, folks. And uh, once again, go down below, check the description out. I got a bunch of people down there that's in my family. There's not enough room to list them all, but it's some of them. But, uh, waffles. All right, well, we're three gaming. Let's, uh, go have some waffles and then we'll check out the cool hats when we're done. That's all I do. <laughs> all right, folks. 
Y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see y'all later.